Hey guys, as you know, the new Mac OS is here. So what you guys should know is that you shouldn't update right away. And that's because if you use your Mac for work or school or anything important, that means a bunch of your apps will not work right away with Mac OS. That's because a lot of apps need to update themselves in order to work with this. For example, one of the most common ones for photographers out there is Canon Utility. Now you use that to control your Canon camera as well as import pictures. That usually takes a few months for Canon to update their software in order to work. Obviously there's other apps out there and other stuff that need updating in order to work properly with the new Mac OS and they're just not gonna work like they should. So at this point, I would say, although yes, you might be very excited about the new Mac OS, hang on, just wait for it. Wait for everybody to catch up to Mac and then go ahead. And yes, all developers have had enough time to catch up with Mac. There's been beta versions for this new Mac OS since way before. However, still they haven't updated a bunch of apps. So not everything will work. Some apps with some developers, they will take weeks, other months, and others, they just will not update to the new Mac OS. So that means you guys should not update just yet. So hold your horses, don't do it. Just hold on, okay? I give the same warning with every single Mac OS that comes out. You guys should always wait, because there's always glitches, there's always stuff in it. Plus, the most important thing is that not all your apps are gonna work. So just hold on. If you guys already did the update, hopefully you guys have installed Time Machine on your Mac and that way you guys can just go back in time before you did this update. So that's it for this quick warning for you guys thinking about updating to the newest Mac OS. Just think about it, research your top apps if they do work. Just go into their official website, see if they're compatible with the new Mac OS. Sometimes they do give you a warning that they're not. Sometimes they don't say anything. That usually means that they're not compatible just yet. Or else those certain apps will see on their website they are in fact compatible with the newest Mac OS. Anyways, that would be it for this video warning. <laughs> if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.